the condition 1 and 2 ensure that base emitter junction shall remain properly forward bias during all parts of signal. On the other hand, condition third ensure that base collector junction shall remain properly reverse bias at all times. Inwards, the fulfillment of this condition will ensure that transistor work over the active region of the output characteristics between saturation to cutoff. Proper zero signal collector current consider NPN transistor circuit shown the this unfaithful figure. This is the VBB and VCC and triggering circuit and this is the load circuit and the positive half cycle of the signal the base is positive the emitter hence base emitter junction is forward bias when it's positive half cycle when it's positive half cycle and then then the result that positive half cycle of the signal is amplified in the collector as shown during the negative half cycle of the signal PS emitter junction is reverse based and hence no current follows the circuit. The result that there are no output due to the negative half cycle of the signal. Those we shall get amplified output the signal with negative half cycle completely cut off which is unfaithful amplification. So firstly we know that the faithful amplification and secondly we know that uh, unfaithful amplification. Uh, so, we uh, say it proper zero signal to collector current and minimum proper base emitter voltage in instant is faithful amplification and thirdly the minimum proper collector emitter voltage are instantly unfaithful amplification. So, thank you.